society platform for eminent authors engaging teachers successful students to know more email last peres method last peres method uses the quantities consumed during the base period in computing the index number this method is commonly used which requires quantity measures for only one period last peres price index calculates the changes changes in the aggregate value of the base year's list of goods when valued at current year's prices a last peres met index number is simpler in calculation and can be computed once the current year prices are known as the weights of the base year quantities in a price index this also enables easy comparability of one index with another last peres price index is equal to sigma p1 q0 by sigma p0 q0 by 100 last peres quantity index is equal to sigma p0 q1 by sigma p0 q0 by 100 where p0 is price in base year p1 the price in current year q0 quantities in the base year q1 quantities in the current year so the following table shows the first column shows the commodity the second column quantity in base year next column shows the quantity in current year next column p0 shows price in base year p1 shows the price in current year next column p0 q0 is the product of price in base year and quantity in base year the next column p1 q0 shows price in current year and quantity in base year and the last column shows p0 q1 shows price in base year and quantity in current year the last row shows the respective sigma value the total value of the respective column so last pares price index is equal to sigma p1 q0 by sigma p0 q0 by 100 is equal to 92990 by 0.30 by 67059.90 into 100 and last pairs quantity index is equal to sigma p0 q1 by sigma p0 q0 by 100 is equal to 82454.90 by 67059.90 into 100 is equal to 122.96 thank you for watching the video kindly write your comments click on the red subscribe button at the bottom of the video to get more details and free ebook email us